हेलो एवरीबडी माय नेम इज शिव कन्या आई वेलकम यू टू एन इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक व्हिच इज रिलेटेड टू ग्राउंड एज यू नो ग्राउंड इज द अर्थ अंडर आवर फीट द ग्राउंड इज रिलेटेड टू अ नंबर ऑफ इडियम्स एंड फ्रेजेस व्हिच रिफर टू एग्रीमेंट्स व्यूज डिसएग्रीमेंट्स एंड ओपिनियंस ऑफ पीपल इट मींस इफ यू अग्री और डिसएग्री विद पीपल यू कैन यूज दीज इडियम्स एंड साउंड मोर इफेक्टिव बोथ इन योर स्पोकन एंड रिटन इंग्लिश but before we go ahead i'd like to suggest you to watch a lesson in which i have described some wonderful idioms which are related to heart in another video i have given the explanation of some idioms which are related to hand and fingers the link is given in the i button and in the description box please watch those lessons you will get some wonderful expressions as usual i request you to like share comment and subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to get notification of the new uploads let's start with today's episode idioms related to ground the first category is of accepting the ideas or the opinions for example we share a lot of common ground so i think we will work well together the phrase is the idiom is common ground to share common ground means things we agree on having similar opinions and similar experiences when we are on common ground when we share the same opinions and experiences we can work together the second one the idea that organic food is better for people and the environment is gaining ground the phrase is to gain ground like in the example the organic food is better not only for people people's health but for environment also and this idea is gaining ground it is becoming more popular it is being accepted by people sometimes we want to oppose the idea or the views in such cases you can use these idioms she decided to stand her ground and not to be persuaded by others the phrase is stand her ground it means to refuse to change her opinion sometimes we do not want to change our opinion because we know what it is exactly in this case you can say to stand one's ground means not to change the opinion next example i think you are on dangerous ground if you try to change the financial system the phrase is on dangerous ground means to hold an opinion that may upset people sometimes even disappoint and offend the people if you are holding that kind of opinion that is called on dangerous ground like for example if you are going to change the financial system all of a sudden then you are on dangerous ground sometimes the people in the system want to change everything all of a sudden and they create a dangerous ground for themselves okay now the third category is of changing opinion or argument for this we have some idioms for a long time neither side would give ground but now they are ready to consider each other's position the idiom is give ground give ground means to accept the other side's position the other side's opinion or views like in the example neither side was not ready to accept each other's opinion but now they are giving ground means they are considering other people's opinion other parties views the next idiom is it's difficult to argue with richa because she keeps shifting her ground the idiom is shift one's ground shifting her ground means changing her opinions and arguments and it is really very difficult with these kind of people who keep shifting their grounds who keep shifting their opinions every now and then at one moment they say something different and the next moment they change their own opinion in such cases it is really very difficult to have any conversation or to have an argument with these kind of people let's have a quick recap of all these idioms common ground means similar opinions or similar experiences gain ground means become popular being accepted stand one's ground means to refuse to change the opinion 
on dangerous ground means to hold an opinion that may upset people give ground means accept the other side's position or opinions shift the ground means change one's opinion keep changing one's opinion so these are some idioms that we have seen so far you are going to write in the comment section one of these that you liked the most if possible you can make a sentence by using that idiom just a gentle reminder before taking a leave if you find this video a little bit informative even please like share comment and subscribe to the channel we'll be back very soon with one more new lesson till then keep watching keep learning keep growing learn english with shivakanya thank you for your time love and support peace